Yo, what's going on guys? I have an insane new new mid gameplay for you. I'll be trying to show you what to do, when to do it, and how to do it. So sit back, relax, and enjoy some full AP new new goodness. There's a way to do it. You basically want a W like right here. This is how you invade on new new boys. Well, I didn't turn the corner very well. But that's the general gist is you use the base movement speed like midway through there and you uh, you hit a nice little pop. I kind of messed it up though. Hit somebody. What is she doing, boys? Jin's going to die for that. I don't think that's worth it for him. Guaranteeing his death and blowing both of his sums is... Well, I guess his... Flash, he has smite for some reason. Wait, he lives. Okay, I'm sad. <laughs> this game's not going well for me. <clears throat> I could have potentially lit it, but I didn't really want to blow my sums. Oh well. We'll use our W. Teach TF a lesson. Kill the back wave. <clears throat> It's hard to match Nunu's wave clear unless you're like Malzahar or Tristana. And you can look for roams. I don't really have anything to roam onto. We'll use our water walking to set up a snowball. Yeah, we'll find it here. TF's wave clear is actually really bad. Like level one. Landed it. Pike, what happened? Pike, you silly goose. All right, let's get our... Probably get our Q next to reshove the wave, and then we can just hang out here in the river. Hanging out in the river is your best friend on Nunu. On your first back, you're gonna want to get some control words. It's a lot of damage. They, they they really need to respect your W. They can't raw fight you out like that. You can just disengage like I did there. We'll use our water walking speed up. Pretty sure the speed up stays with the snowball the full time, just like Scuttle Crab does. Land it, ignite him, auto attack Q, and he's dead. And his wave shoving to me as well, so. We have him right where we want him, boys. We'll eat that. Oof, we missed that one. That's tragic. Can't rotate bot, it's too shoved in. But we'll have to we'll wait on that one. Kind of kind of freezing it right now. I guess I could go topside. I'm just not in a particular rush. All right, here we go. This is it. New new mid plays really well with his junglers. I kind of messed up though. Got her. That's double buff. Scuttle crab kind of got in my way. We gotta give that. Thing. I have double buffs. I think I can chunk this guy down. Garen went back topside. You're all by yourself. Uh, what a chump. Even though you start with your W, it's actually not best to max first. It's actually better to go for a Q max into E max. Your W doesn't get any faster per level, and in terms of base damage, your E is uh, it's realistically better to max first over your Q. Your W gets faster per champion level, not per level that you put into it. Which is kind of lame, it's just how it is. I think they did that, that way Nunu could go for a Q max in the jungle without it putting him in a bad spot because he could still move fast off a of W with levels. Oh, he's sneaky. Bop him with my autos, and he's gone. You wouldn't want to play Nunu against a really strong bully mid laner like Cassiopeia or Syndra. Against a TF or melee champions, I think Nunu mid has, has some pretty interesting things that he can do. <clears throat> Very interesting things. Uh, 
All right, we'll look for another roam. Then we'll back, get a control word. Go for the TF. Scuttle crabs are your best friend. We can W off of that. Looks like TF is laying a ward though. Little does he know. I know how to drift. Drift God Nunu. If you're not used to drifting, you should go into practice tool, des test out different movement speeds and kind of figure out how hard you need to pull. It's the same thing with Scion. <clears throat> It's just one of those things. Until you practice it or you've done it enough, it's hard to do, but it's, it's actually very simple once you get the feel for it. It's like driving a car isn't hard to do, but when you try it for the first time, it's kind of weird. I feel like for me, when I first drove a car, it wasn't weird because we have a, this is gonna sound stupid, but we had a riding lawnmower that I used a lot. I'd always have to like mow our large yard, right? Child labor OP. I was so accustomed to that, <clears throat> to the, the car, it was still a little awkward, but it wasn't that bad. We still have our R here. I'll go ahead and reset. <laughs> TF says that's hilarious. <laughs> All right. On your first back, you're normally looking to get a Dark Seal since you're doing a lot of roams and kills. We'll pick up a Sork Shoe and a Hextech Alternator with a Control Ward and an Oracle Lens. Since we're going to be doing a lot of roaming, breaking vision and taking vision control is absolutely huge. Your E synergizes really well with uh, Hextech Rocket Belt, if you were wondering why we're taking that. Night Harvester isn't bad, Hextech Rocket Belt's a little bit better for landing your E snares and your getting in position to R. Can't get to him. If you do want to shove wave, it's usually best to go off to the side and do it, or you can back really far up and just blow it up like that. Like I said, you don't want to stay in stay in lane too much. You're better off roaming. We'll find a play on TF here. I don't believe this flashes up. Got him. I haven't even had to use my R this game. It's kind of funny. I want the Garen. Once again, go for Emax second, W Max last. Nope, here it is. I should have gone the other way along the tri brush. That sucks. Oh god, why is pushing me? Ooh, that's a lot of damage. I'm out of mana though. This is not good. Pike press R, Pike. Oh, Pike. <laughs> oh, all right. I'm gonna get out of here. I need to get out. I'm out of mana. Your R costs a lot. They, they thought it'd be funny if they made Nunu's R cost 100 mana when he only has a 500 mana pool. Thanks, Riot. Snare him first, take off his shield, then we'll Q him. And we'll use this speed up to destroy TF. Actually, he's not really stepping up very far. Is he gonna keep going? I don't know what he's doing. I'd rather just back and get a blasting wand. It's gonna give me a lot of extra damage. A lot, a lot of damage. Right, let's get back in there. Our pink ward's still up. We can roam onto the bot lane. Nuna, you do fall off a little bit at some point. If you can maintain your dark seal stacks or mesh stacks, you'll have a lot better scaling similar to an Evelyn. It's very rare that you'll get the enemy's turret unless they're roaming a lot themselves. Since you're roaming so much, you're not really gonna be there to break plates. That did a lot of damage too. That was probably like three, four hundred damage. Yep, it did. 
<laughs> it looks like I did about half his health. Kind of funny. Cue the cannon minion. Since we're does so much damage. I'll drift this bad boy around town. Get him up to full girth. I don't think this guy's ever played against a new new mid before. <laughs> he just... I don't know what he's doing, but I like it. He, he's using moves I've never seen before. <clears throat> I think this is probably a good matchup for Nunu as well. If TF goes to stun card you, it's pretty easy to land your W on him. And at the same time, he doesn't have the raw damage to solo you. Like, 1v1 you to the death, so. I am very thankful we're not playing against a Syndra or a Cassiopeia. That would be absolutely painful. My R is up. <clears throat> I can't do anything there. TF's probably coming over here too. I don't see him though. I'll get Lux here. Oh, TF just saw me. How lame is that? I wanted to kill the Lux. I missed. He did a good job hugging the turret. I don't like this situation anymore. This is not good. <clears throat> I didn't use my E on it because I kind of want to fight them. Autumn. I don't get to use my R ever. I have too much damage. This is an issue. I have too much damage. I can't actually use my R. Hey, bye. Smack her with the E. She has nowhere to go. Nice. We're going to just back now. <laughs> like, we don't have any mana. If we had the mana, we could shove this wave out real quick. I guess technically we do, but we're going to have to wait for it. We'll go ahead and pick up a... Ooh, give me the mesh. Yeah, give me that mesh. We'll buy another pink ward just in case. Once you have 9 or 10 Dark Seal stacks in your head, obviously, you should go for the mesh. Then you can get your Proto Belt and Devoid Staff into, like, Rabadon. Things like that. After Proto Belt, you can even get Hourglass if you need to, if they have, like, a Zed or something. <clears throat> He probably should have gotten Merc Treads against me or for Swifties. He's having issues dodging my Snowball. Alright, I'm gonna back up. That wasn't a very good W. <laughs> oh well. Your W is best for one-shotting the backline minions. You just let go of it, so you slide into it. It takes the slide damage, and then... You let go of your W, and since your snowball's inside of them, it blows up. I don't know why he just used his R. TF, why do you do the things that you do? Oh, oh my champ's walking the wrong way. Got his flash, I'll take it. Ignite finished him off. <clears throat> Garen's doing Garen things topside. Not on my watch. Actually, I'm on a pink word, so maybe on my watch. Oh, uh, was there a blast cone? <clears throat> I don't know if there was a blast cone. I don't know where Garen went. He could have just gone deeper into our jungle. I have decent CS, all things considered. 92 CS, brown tree, even Romy. <clears throat> Frickin' Raptors, man. It's outrageous. Raptors getting in my way. I'd say Nunu mid, the only way to play it is AP, like I'm doing here. For Nunu jungle, you're a lot better off going tank Nunu. Tank Nunu's way better on Nunu jungle. Nice. 
I'm out of mana. It's the one downside to this type of setup. Am I dead? All right, <laughs> that was, I got outbalanced by Stridebreaker Garen. That was a lot of damage. That was some nutty damage, man. We can still carry it. Still winnable. I have full proto belt now. We still have 10 plus mesh stacks. Looks like they're backing. We are, we're already up two dragons. If we get drags on this, it should be in the bag. I landed it. Mm. Oh, this is so much fun. Ripperoni pipe. Lux and Morgana can be really annoying for Nunu. They'll snare you out of your snowball and they have so much range on it. No way. No. What is going on? Yeah, they're just gonna stun me out of it. Problem is, if I like, do a heavy engage, there's a good chance Garen's just gonna shit on my head. I got my big R shield there. Got a tap off on it. It's a huge shield. Wraps are up nice. I'll be helping myself to these. Power belt finish them off. I can't really get over there. They're in a weird spot. See what you can do to TF. It's full HP. If I got off my ignite, I could have killed him. I didn't pinch. Dragon's up in 55. We really need to fight for that. Oof, so many wards. Go ahead and reset, get my mana back. We can go for Dead Man's Plate here as well. You don't have to go Void Staff Robot on second item, especially if you don't have a bunch of med stacks. I think Dead Man's Plate would actually be better here to keep me alive. Their team's mostly AD. Their only AP is the behind TF and support Lux. So Dead Man should keep our stacks up, which is the most important. What is the clear path for Nunu? It depends. It's typically red into wraps into gank. He has a lot of different clear paths he can run, though. I love getting snared out of my snowballs. That's worth trading Garen for Pike. That's insanely good for us. Garen has a ridiculous amount of gold. Nice bait, said Juwani. I don't want a W here. Run him down. We should drag and there's no need to chase Lux. Chasing Lux is going to be difficult when she's already has a lead on you. Chill out. Just throw out a snare. Completely cuck you. Nice, nice. Dragon time. Well done, Sejuani. Sejuani's putting in some work, man. It's got lots of kills and assists, some good baits. Got him. Yeah, you bet you guys thought I was going for the Garen there. There's no way. There's no way I can't kill him. I can kill Squishies.
the heck is this? Ooh! It's a lot of damage. Love that R. I had to be patient with it. Do it, Lux. Do it! Yeah! Machine gun Nunu, guys. <laughs> That's why you max your E second. Base damage on it gets nuts. Now we have full mesh stacks. Beautiful. After Dead Man's, we'll go for Robidon. Since we do have so many stacks. He's a goner. No, 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 no! Bye. That's dirty. That cost me 10 mesh. All because of pathing. I took a few extra turret shots for whatever reason. Unfortunate. Dude, has got a thick hitbox. You just use the word cuck as in Lux will cuck you. What does that word mean to you? It means whatever I want it to mean, Hardcore Hordak. It's an ever-changing, developing word. Just like the word simp. I use it to destroy my foes and cripple my adversaries. No foes it. Adversaries are same thing. What up, King? Not much. CSM. Raptor? Just chilling. Thoughts on Rise? Rise is a bit of a stinker. Rise is a big stinky. Rise is uh, kind of like the AP also, but he just runs it down for the first 30 minutes. And then he scales and does all sorts of stuff. Do it! Ooh! ya! Landed my proto belt on her. Got the dark harvest. Yeah, I cancelled my W so she wouldn't land that. Good stuff. I can hop the wall here and wreck her. Little did she know. What was that flash, though? That was a really close fight, man. Really close. I was trembling. That's why I loved Dead Man's play. It's just so good. Tank turrets like crazy. Yeah, look at Vi trying to hit me. Oh! Yeah. But last time I did that, I got one shot. That's the power of Dead Man's Plate. So much armor. It even gives you damage on hit. 100 magic damage when you're at full stacks. Oh, I can't drift. It wouldn't let me drift it. I was moving too quick. We could take a big fight here. My R's back up. Sitting on 25 mesh. You know, you're in trouble when you hear a wacha. Yeah. You heard that a lot more when I'm playing Nasus. Nasus can get away with doing things like that. Land of the snare, baby. Do it, TF. Do it. Do it, Jin. Do it. Do it. All right, GG, guys. Well played. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is King Sticks, and thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.